<laughs> so am I. She's tired. Look, she's falling asleep on me. Yeah. Say hi, baby. She's Come here. Kisses. <laughs> and if it'd be really great if she decided not to try to follow me every time I got up to go to the bathroom. She gonna follow you? She might just be so content you know, you're gonna get on the rhythm. bed. You're gonna get your rhythm. You're gonna get your rhythm. Put the music. Mm. We have oh, one dress. Wardrobe. We have a shirt. I, of course, a shirt because Carol Carol's has to insist. have the t-shirt. Okay. <laughs> Red, white, and blue. Show the dress. Turn it around. Oh, excuse now me. Now the other way. This the other way. way with the lace on it. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Very patriotic for the Fourth of July. <laughs> oh, that's, that's right. That's right. I didn't even think of that. Oh, oh, I love the ladybug. And a ladybug dress. Okay. Look at all your stuff. I told you Rosanna has to give up for her closet. And Carol's shirt that she liked? No, it's a little Marian picked that one. I like it too. Well, I love it, but I'm just... Hi, guys. Hey, hey everybody. No, oh. This is Carol's mommy. Say hey, Roseanne. Hey, She's hey. like a movie star. <laughs> Aunt Miriam. Hi, Miriam. <laughs> Miriam. Say hi, Aunt Marie. Hi there. That's the mommy. <laughs> That's the mommy. So, That's Ingrid's mommy. And there's our sweet little Morgan Ingrid, one of the babies that we rescued from the Hialeah tent city. She's got more stuff in her goodie basket. We are here. We just, uh, we've actually been at um, Carol's mom, Ann's home, um, for quite some time. Carol and I actually picked her up from the animal hospital, and we got all of her things together. Uh, she's in her, as you can see, cannot be too safe. She has her harness. She has her martingale. Aunt Marie, let's see. Show. Show. Hey, Come here, hey, Mama. Mom. She has her beautiful, beautiful new little tag with her address and everything on it. <laughs> she's falling asleep. We put the dress on her. She feels safe with the dress around. And that's the mommy. This is the mommy. And the baby. Hey, hi, mommy and the baby. Aunt Marie um, is one of the most beautiful, beautiful people I've, I've ever met. And the biggest heart, like all of us, um, she lives for her animals. She always, she really does. And um, I've had a dog all my life. Whole life. And sadly, um, she lost our sweet Bogart, who was a beautiful Bichon and was so loved and adored. And she's never been the same ever since. Every time we come to visit, which is... In Delray, and we live in Fort Lauderdale. We go there every holiday, um, and she's just never been the same. And uh, this is what's going to bring Aunt Marie back to life, for sure. They're going to rescue. I can't other. imagine my life. I can't imagine my life. Could you, Carol, without God, a dog no. in it? I couldn't. It gives no, me purpose. No. Remember, I said that to you at dinner that night. And my mom lives there and my uncle lives there it's a beautiful it's a beautiful they have a beautiful home which i'm going to continue this video when we get back but i just wanted to show our little shopping spree um we've been there we had dinner there we've been hanging out little ingrid morgan jumped right up on the couch and made herself at home um, they've already bought stairs leading up to her bed where she's going to be sleeping with aunt marie uh, there's just not an an inch of the home that is not hers that she's not welcome uh, this is a true animal an animal home and, and family. It, takes, it does take a village. In this case, it takes a family. Sure does. It takes a family. Because you couldn't do this by yourself. I could not do no, it by myself. No, she could not. And that's why she has her sister, who is Carol's mommy, that's right. and your brother, Uncle Charlie. Yes. And, and, you, and you will meet him. And too. believe me, you'll meet him. What a treat. <laughs> <laughs> but this is the best part. They're all retired. They're home all the time. And, and this this baby girl right here is going to and be the Aunt center, and Aunt Marion. the center of their world, the center of their world, and all she wants honestly is to be held and coddled. That's all she wants. She's so sleepy. She's, She's so, so sleepy. Yeah. She's just falling yes, down. So we are going to check out with her new dress and her new stuff. Um, I'll show you when we get back to the house all the. <laughs> All the things that they've done well, too. Going to have to give up part of her closet. <laughs> you have to give up part of your closet because Ingrid's going to have her own wardrobe. She can't have everything. <laughs> uh, we're just shopping. We're getting all kinds of goodies and chew toys and antlers and.
just all kinds of goodies for her. And we brought the food, and she and ate a little. And the necessaries. They have a very big backyard. There's a pool. Um, they're actually screening in a certain. They separated the pool, screened off the pool, so there would be no accidents. Uh, they're doing everything. There's not an inch of the house that's not going to be dog proof because we this all. This rescue is the most expensive dog I've ever owned. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't even started. You wait, Aunt Marie. You wait. Are you ready to check out? And we'll continue this when we get back to home. Okay. Let's do it. Over and out. Over and out. This is right. Amy with our awesome, happy. This is our adoption, guys. But we'll continue when we get back we'll to the house. The eyes at the house. Yes, we'll kiss the eyes at the house. One hundred plus abandoned dogs of Everglades, Florida. Let's do it, girls. Oh. Let's do it. Yep. Here goes the back. The back is going. That's all, that's all I can do. Here goes Aunt Marie. <laughs> <laughs> you might want to help her drive with that oh. cart. So cute. This is going to bring her back to life. Um, and she has Carol's mom and her brother, all three of them, in a beautiful home. And they're retired. It's going to be beautiful. My and of baby. course, Carol and I are there to watch every step. My baby. <laughs> you were going to be so spoiled. Not too spoiled. Nuh uh. We'll, we'll, we'll see in a little bit, guys.